Hello, this is Victor at RestoreMercedes.com. Today, I just want to show this throttle body here, right? So this is the unit, and I just gave it a wash. You know, I cleaned it up externally. And um, this is what it looked like after, this is what it looks like actually, after a wash. If you look at it, it's, you know, very nice, You're clean, right? It's actually pretty pretty nice presentable unit and look at this there is no oxidation and I didn't really have to use any mechanical abrasions this is just chemical wash now given that somebody tried to clean lots of gunk that accumulated under the throttle plate you can see all these scratches that wasn't me I just had to clean it um, chemically so chemical cleaning does not create all these scratches but other than that, look at this, it's just beautiful, beautiful looking piece. Now, if we're going to look closely, this unit was produced in 1994. Here is the date stamp on it. I don't know if it shows. 1993. And it's the second month, second month of 1993. But look at this thing, this is nice. I mean, usually... A unit that is 1993 is never gonna is never gonna look like this. It will never look like this. It's gonna be. I, I don't want to bring out the examples, but say something like this. That's more like it. Okay, <laughs> that is more like it. This is what you see. Okay. Ooh, look! Something just fell out of it. So yeah, this and this you compare it to day and night all right that is just the parts unit that i just picked up from the floor now move along this particular unit came from 400e it's a non-asr unit and uh well these are the pieces from insulation that we see fallen in and again i have to just wash off the internals but that's a different kind of uh, the different process the case this case was produced in 1992 there is a stamp there so it's relatively old unit very old so the car is obviously a 94 um production by the win number and registration it's 1994 although probably built in 1993 based on the throttle body being uh, february 1993 well nonetheless i'm just saying just that's what it looks like then that's um some oxidation points here yes there is some yes there is some over here but um main gear seems okay I have to still check the rest but I'm not gonna do it before I clean it it just came out from like I said chemical wash I cut the wire on the coil and then we'll look at the coil resistance and that shows four ohms I'm good with that okay <clears throat> and now the wiring we try to make a close-up on the actual wires how bad those are as you can see they're pretty much absolutely destroyed out there i mean in there you can see bare copper absolutely nothing left from insulation there's a motor wire in there it's hard for me to really catch this the wiring here but anyway you can probably see it see this is like just pure copper I'm gonna replace them all of course I'm gonna fix this unit but um, yeah this is pretty terrible try to maybe shine some more light in there shine some light where light does not shine there we have it yeah that's that's pretty bad so <clears throat> the actual unit based on the paperwork and based on the vehicle has a hundred and seventy thousand miles it's a 1994 vehicle and um, given the condition if 
somebody would look at it you'll be like wow that's a nice unit but internally it will be the wires on this particular one the wires are totally destroyed so the point here is not about the mileage and it's not about the overall look it's about what wires look like okay so wires could be completely messed up but throttle body can look very very nicely so yeah so i'll continue working on this unit and that's basically the whole point of this video um just to show that the uh, unit can be nice wires are bad whatever and uh now i'll start working on this unit i'm repeating myself i know but it's been a long day we have snow in the middle of march and uh, just so many things in my head all right so <clears throat> moving along i'll get this unit repaired all right so this is it victor here with storymercedes.com thank you for watching